What's up guys, it's Trevor with Embers Living. We're getting a question, a question, we're getting questions a lot about what Napoleon prestige model is right for you. So we thought we'd do a video breaking down all the different prestige models, uh, which is our best selling Napoleon grill. So we're gonna go through all the prestige models. There's even one that isn't here. Wait a second, what is this doing in here? This is a Rogue. We have a separate video that breaks down the Rogue from the Prestige. Stay tuned, you can click a link in the bio to watch that one. All right, man, you ready for the Prestige video? Let's do the Prestige one. All right, before we get started, don't forget if you're in the Denver, Colorado area, our showroom is in Westminster. So come to our showroom, you guys can get hands on with these products and uh, check them out for yourself. If you're not local, just check them out on our website. We'll include links where you can purchase right on our website. Okay, so we're breaking down the Prestige Series. The Prestige Series is gonna be the high-end product that Napoleon offers. It is made up in Canada, and it's our most popular, best-selling grill. So let's break, break it down. Comes in three different sizes. So this is the regular Prestige model. So this is more, you know, sort of the starting point within the Prestige family. Let's go over some of the features. Um, so essentially this is the 500. It does come in two different sizes. You can get the regular Prestige in two size options. This is the four burner or a little over a 32 inch grill head. Or you can order it, this is the Pro, which we'll get into later. You can order it in the 665 version, which is the five burner. One, two, three, four, yeah, five burner, I'm right. Uh, the five burner. So you essentially have like a 40 inch grill head or like a 30 inch grill head. So you can get the regular Prestige in either size model. So those are your two size choices. Now we're gonna talk about this. We almost never sell them this. Where's our rotisserie at, man? Where's our rotisserie kit? Anyways, we'll get to that later. So you can buy the regular Prestige without the rotisserie burner, without the rotisserie kit, and without the infrared side burner, which we will talk about. Problem is we almost sell zero of that combination. I bet we sell one a year, if that. And the reason is, it only saves you a couple hundred dollars and just a rotisserie kit is almost a couple hundred. So just getting a rotisserie pays for that, let alone the side burner. So this exact combo, the Prestige 500 with the rotisserie and the infrared side burner, the RSIB is what it's called, a P500 RSIB, hands down our number one selling grill because it's so much bang for your buck. You're gonna get a lifetime warranty, made in Canada, top to bottom, and it's really, really well priced. So you get an awesome grill for a really affordable price. We, it does run on batteries, so we're gonna have a battery pack here for our lights, and then they're gonna turn red when our burners are on. However, the burners themselves don't need power. Our main burners don't require any power because see, they got a little spark igniter in them. Uh, we're just using an, our battery powered igniter for our rear burner and our side burner. Does have stainless steel cooking grates. The 500 comes with the cast aluminum tub and then our main burners themselves, which are all connected. You guys have probably seen that in other videos. We can kind of skim through this. If you want more details, you can kind of watch some of our other videos where we really break these grills down. And then our infrared burner, which gets up to 1800 degrees, has a cast iron cooking grate on it. And then the grill itself, just nice, simple. As far as colors, let's talk about colors. This side shelf folds down. Comes in stainless steel, which of course is our best selling. You can do a black enamel finish, which we don't have out. Make sure to show them a picture of that. Black, it's like a black shiny enamel. What's nice about that is that enamel is pretty indestructible, like it doesn't scratch or anything. So it's pretty bulletproof. Um, or it comes in a gray finish. So I'm already getting confusing. Let's make this simple. So the Prestige comes in two sizes. Comes in the 500 and the 665. You can order it without this infrared side burner and without the rotisserie or with it. I highly recommend getting it because it's it's an inconsequential price difference and you get a lot more value. Then, last thing we want to mention is we have the special limited edition. We don't know how long these are going to be around, 
but we have the Phantom series. So if you're interested in this color, this is a matte black finish, tricked out head to toe on this grill, the whole thing's blacked out. And then we have our cast stainless cooking grates, which are definitely a fan favorite. This has been really popular, don't you think? Mm -hmm. We are definitely gonna sell out of these grills. I think we're nearly sold out now, and I don't know if they'll be getting replenished. And then our special edition warming rack where we can hang drums, drumsticks or jalapeno poppers. So that's the regular Prestige series. Does that sound confusing or does, are you making sense of all of it? Sense. I feel like it sounds confusing. I mean, it's a lot, but it's making It's sense. a lot. Let's make it simple. One more time. Two sizes, 500, 30 inch, 40 inch. Okay, 30, 40 inch. Choose your size. Choose whether you want the side burners and rotisserie. Always recommend it because again, big price difference and then choose your color. Simple? I make it more simple. Also fuel type, you can get it propane or natural gas. So one more choice you have to make. All right, should we move to the Pro? Let's move to the Pro series. Now, unlike the regular Prestige series, the Pro series, which we have here, comes in three sizes, not to confuse you even more. But what's nice is you don't have to mess with the rotisserie burner and the side burner. The Pro series comes absolutely loaded up. Just like the regular Prestige series, you can see that the sizing is the same. So a lot of people think when I get the Pro 500 versus the Prestige 500, I'm getting a bigger grill. No, you're not. They're the exact same size. So the Pro 500 is the same size as the Prestige 500. The Pro 665 is the same size as the Prestige 665. You just get more features. What are the features you get? Well, it comes chromed out, which some people like, some people don't but we have little handles on our, on our side shelves. We get the multicolor lighting system. So if I hold this in, it'll change colors. And then let's see, it will rotate colors as well. We have our motion light on the floor. So what that means is, let's say the interior and exterior lighting is on. If, it, if no one's around it for a while, they'll power off. And as you approach the grill, it will all fire back up, which is really cool, I think. Obviously, we get interior lighting as an upgrade. Um, we also get thicker cooking grates. So these cooking grates are a little bit thicker than the regular size. So a little bit thicker diameter, a little beefier. And then on our side burner, instead of cast iron, we go to stainless steel. So we get a stainless steel upgrade on this as well. And again, we have the interior lighting now, as far as the cabinet goes, we're gonna get soft closed storage drawers on these, which again is nice. And it's definitely a little more robust, a little beefier. And then we have underlit cabinets as well with a little storage facility. So our, our underneath the cabinet is an upgrade too. It's not just the grill itself. Burners are exactly the same. So the way these two grills cook is gonna be identical. It's just, you're getting a lot more bells and whistles a lot beefier grill, same warranty too. So you're really paying for the add-ons with the Pro Series. With the 665, it is essentially the exact same thing. Same features we just talked about on the 500 minus one upgrade. On the 665, we get an extra, and this is just on the Pro, we get an extra smoker tray. So there's a smoker tray in here you can fill with wood chips or pellets. And then underneath that, there's burner for it. So there's gonna be a burner for that as well, so you do get that extra feature. With the Pro Series, the grill does need to be plugged in, and that is, of course, for your lighting. Your main burners will still work without power because they're the same igniters. And again, you use power for your secondary burners, things like that. And then as far as your rotisserie goes, what's really cool is you can plug this grill in in the back, and there's a receptacle in the back. You can plug your rotisserie motor right into the grill itself, so you're not running multiple cords, which is pretty handy. Did we mention there's a third size? We didn't tell them about the third size, did we? Should we talk about that a little bit? All right, let's talk about that. So Elijah didn't feel like moving this one because it's the big dog. So this is the Pro 825. Now this does not come in the regular Prestige series. It only is available in the Pro. But it's honestly a totally different grill. The Pro 825, one grill head. Your main cooking space is, is pretty close to the Prestige 500 size. Um, same concept, it does have the same smoker tray as the Pro 665. You can see we do have our rotisserie burner. 
And then over here we have a separate grill head. What's cool about this is our infrared burners are inside the grill. And instead of one, we get two. But there's a really cool third feature over here, and that's a warming burner. So underneath here, let's just show you. Let's just show you. There's our, isn't that cute? Little cute little warming burner. So what's really cool about that is, what I like about it is this is actually a lot more useful, especially if you're not using your ceramic burners. Let's say you got food over here and it's done and you need to pull it. You can just turn this warming burner on like a little simmer and it's gonna keep everything warm, which is really handy. So you can almost use this as a separate little station. Because it's so much bigger, we go to way more storage here. So we have the same soft closed storage door. Oh, there we go. That's our drip tray, by the way. And then we have these pull out little storage doors that are also soft closed. It's also where we keep our catalogs, which you don't have to do that at home. There'd be no reason for you to do that, but kind of cool. So if our infrared burners are on the inside, then clearly we have another use here and that's this big bad dog power burner. So this is some crazy BTU power burner. Uh, we have multiple levels, so it's super, super high BTU, so you can boil, things like that. This does sit low, so you can put a wok in here or something really cool. So again, it's multifaceted. We forgot to talk about it in the regular pros, but the Pro 500 and 665 also come with this, and that's a cutting board and ice bucket. To me, the ice bucket is more gimmicky than anything but the cutting board is helpful. That is something I would actually use. Okay, why would you buy this grill? Besides being big and having all the bells and whistles, um, I would say this grill is the most useful to me if you're tr almost like trying to replicate an outdoor kitchen, but you don't wanna do like a full on outdoor kitchen. Why do I say that? I say that because we're dealing with multiple stations here. We have storage, we got plenty of storage inside the grill. We have warming or prep stations. We also have sear stations. We have a main cooking area. We have a huge rotisserie kit. And then we also have a power burner for boiling or wok cooking. So you see what I'm talking about? It's almost replicating an outdoor kitchen the way it's so multifunctional. So that's what I would do. You're, and this grill is really well priced, again, for what it is. Of course, it's the most expensive grill Napoleon sells, but it's, probably less than 30% the cost of, of building your own outdoor kitchen. So it's a great little option if, if you wanna go this route instead of an outdoor kitchen. Of course, it's easier, there's no construction, no lead times. You just buy this grill and plop it on your deck and you essentially have an outdoor kitchen station, if that makes sense. So if that's what you're leaning towards, that's why I would get this grill. All right, should we summarize? All right, so to summarize, again, making it easy for you we have the regular Prestige, which comes in two sizes, 500 and 665. The reason to buy this grill is if you're looking for really, really good value with a lifetime warranty um, made in North America. I think it's the, the hardest grill to beat, especially the 500 under, under the $1,500 price range. I don't think there's a better grill out there. Or if you're looking for the most amount of real estate for your money, Take a look at the Prestige 665. Again, you're getting a ton of real estate for your money. Great, great value. Then we have the Special Edition Phantom Series. This is a one-off deal. Only comes in the 500, but if you really are into the look or the cast stainless burners, definitely check this guy out. If you love all the bells and whistles, I would definitely take a look at the Pro Series. Again, we have the same functionality as the regular Prestige just with more bells and whistles, but as far as cooking in space, it's gonna be the same. Now, a lot of people, the biggest thing people vacillate between is this grill and this grill, and they have a really hard time deciding if they should spend the money on the Pro. And everyone says that this is a sales pitch because we sell these, and I'm not just saying this as a sales pitch. Um, I'll just tell you a little personal experience. I had this grill at our California store, out on our patio in the sun, uncovered for about six years. I ended up closing that California store down about three years ago. Now it sat out on the patio longer than that, it probably sat out there like seven years. 
in the last three years, I gave that grill to my mom. Every time I go and see her, I still cook on it. It still fires up. She doesn't cover it either. So it's been sitting out in the sun for nine years. It fires like a champ. Why am I telling you that? No matter which grill you get, like you will have this grill 20 years. It will last you 20 years, no problem. And so if, if you are really viewing this as a 20 year investment, um, spring the extra money for the pro because you're gonna have this grill forever. So if you want the lighting, the interior lighting, the extra bells and whistles, and it's a long-term investment for you, um, get the pro. Get the prestige if you're kind of just getting started and you don't know how long you're gonna hang on to it, but in the meantime you want a really good quality grill and maybe down the road you'll upgrade, then maybe get the prestige. But if you're in it for the long haul, you wanna buy one grill one time, do the pro, because you're gonna have it forever, so you might as well get the upgrades. In the pro series, we have three sizes, the 500 and the 665, with all the bells and whistles on it. And then for you guys that like the multiple cooking stations, get the 825. Don't view the 825 as just a bigger grill, because it's so much more than that, as we showed you. It's not really the 665, that, but just bigger. It's really like a utility grill, like an all-in-one outdoor kitchen type substitute, if that makes sense. This video has gone on way too long. As always, I always say that. Don't forget to subscribe. You guys have to subscribe. Helps us out a ton when you do that. This is the prestige lineup. Hopefully this video helped you and didn't confuse you even more. Hopefully. Hopefully that makes sense. Hopefully it makes your decision easy. You gotta buy them while you can because they always sell out. This is the Napoleon Prestige Series by Napoleon.